officially the top two teams in world football. We can say that now, but only one will wear the crown. It's the World Cup final coming up live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Germany versus Argentina. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer begins in goal. Niklas Süle starts with Antonio Rüdiger in central defence. Serge Gnabry starts with Leroy Zane in the wide positions. And the focal point in attack is Thomas Müller. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And so the match is underway. Gozens, Joshua Kimmich, David Raum, Gnabry with it, and Müller has it now, it's a promising position you've got to say, well, possibilities inside the box, splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Leon Goretzka. Kimmich. On to Zane. Kimmich. The fans in favour of the shot here. Intercepting it intelligently. Marcos Acuna. And that's great work to keep it in play. Well, Serge Gnabry, a player who possesses real talent. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this match? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas. And he can oh, it's developing nicely for them here. Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. Promising move from Germany. Oh, that's an interesting pass. What's he going to do here? Müller. Determined defending. Well, the fact of the matter is, it should never be a surprise to see Germany in a World Cup final. But equally true is the fact that so many doubted Germany ahead of this World Cup. They have been terrific. They're here on merit. And now, Stuart, they have designs on lifting the trophy for a fifth time. Yeah, you're absolutely right. We weren't quite sure at the start of the tournament what we were going to get from Germany. But the manager has put the tactics right, he's picked the right players. There's a combination of experience as well. 
I think they've looked a really good team and I've got every faith they will win this game today. No frustration for those waiting in the middle. And the referee has given them a corner. Well, they fancy a short one. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. He takes A. Oh, he saved it well. Yeah. And they're going for the short one. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes, yellow card, no. Can he make it 1-0? And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Well, here's the replay, and he just strikes the ball down the middle. The goalkeeper gets out of the way. It's a really good penalty and no danger that the goalkeeper is going to save that. Goal. And the action underway again. The onus very much on Germany to find a response now. Lionel Messi. And he's beaten him here. Good move in the making from Germany. Beautifully weighted ball. Musiala. Goretzka. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And played in by Kimmich. And the ball is loose. Reading it well. Body in the way again. Paredes. And for more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. Real concern for the bench now, because it looks like... Great reflex action from Neuer! They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And deciding to go short with this one. Chance to finish! And increasing the pressure, another corner it is. Another look then at the penalty goal. They take it short. And they stop them in their tracks. In behind for him to chase. And he's in the clear. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Joshua Kimmich with the corner. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Gives it a go. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Well, Argentina haven't had that much of the ball so far, but what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. Superb block. Can they square the game? Surely! Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here's the replay. What a pass this is from Gnabry. And then what a strike. 
That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Martinez, and that's an important intervention. Serge Gnabry, room to roam for Germany on the flank. Müller! Oh, good work by the keeper. Over it comes. Not away completely. Shot attempted. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Paredes. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Good high press, not the best challenge, free kick. And fire from the flank into the area. The fist of the goalkeeper. And so it is, the first half story has been written. And now... So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. It's a neat move. Oh, in with a chance. Oh, it's in. They're in front here. Now can they stay in front? Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Delightful pass. Chance to cross. Happy to take on the shot. And searching for his second, but the keeper equal to the task. Well, he's looking really lively, isn't he? Every time he gets the ball, he looks a threat. Fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Corner to Germany as they look to get back into this game. Let's see about the delivery. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Joshua Kimmich with the corner on the corner too close to the goalkeeper that time Rodrigo de Paul Martinez and that's very good refereeing to let the play flow 
Now, let's see what they can do here. Martinez. Just needs to resolve the danger. Now can they counter clinically? Muller. And a textbook interception. Well, can they be creative from here? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Kimmich. This is Müller. Poor attempt at a pass, really. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Messi. Well, time just challenged magnificently. And Messi with teammates to play it to. Oh, lovely ball. sense that had to go in if they're to turn this around they simply haven't been at the races today time for a change then good move in the making from Germany it's a good looking ball in behind Keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Sané. Good tackle, take it away. Romero. Los Celso. It's with Dybala. Making progress. Oh, lovely work to get past his man. And putting his body on the line. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. <laughs> so, making the substitution. Should now. Keen to take it short here. Can they hit on the break? They need to get bodies back. Well, it fizzled out. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. And teammates around him. Sané. Timo Werner. It's still alive. Werner. Real chance. Oh, there it is. A lifeline in this game. And what a finale we could be in for here. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Well, Germany's still trailing here, but this game very much alive as a contest again. and played the pass well they've got to be really mindful of the time situation attacking though they might be Kimmich return to Jan 
Well, couldn't keep it. Sané. Now Kimmy. Now with Kimmy. Werner. Here's Royce. Not to be this time. Chan. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Counter attacking, very much an option. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Now can they create something? He just needs to keep a cool head. And a goal! Well, here's the replay. What a pass this is from Werner. And then from there, the keeper has little chance. Two on one, left completely exposed, and it made for a simple finish in the end. Well, if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Foul there, free kick awarded. Martinez, no way through. Dybala gives it a go. Nicely saved. Well, this corner could be pivotal. It might represent the last chance to get in front in the dying moments. Not really the ideal clearance. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Can he make it 1-0? And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. So back in business here, the first period of extra time, and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? The attack continues. They're making considerable progress to take the lead. Full credit, wonderful stop. Sané, it has to be. Oh, it's astonishing. One of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see. And now the question is, can they see this out? Well, here it is again, and when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that, it's a poor clearance, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Martinez useful looking position you've got to say not the best challenge free kick into the box it goes Timo Werner now with Havertz it might be on for them penalty's been given and it's not what they had in mind it's falling apart for them and he left the referee with no choice but to dismiss him well it's a double whammy that's a huge blow for them <laughs> 
to extend their lead here. And he swaps it home with confidence. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. Lisandro Martinez. Not the pass he had in mind. David Raum. Royce. Oh, surely. Keeper getting the touch. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Martinez. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store. And so the drama continues here. We're into the second period of extra time. Papu Gomez. Correa. Now with Gomez. Lisandro Martinez. Went in strongly, decisively. Can they hit on the break? A mischievous effort and fired against the crossbar. Goal kick it'll be. Nicolas Otamendi under duress. Messi. A move of promise on the flank. Surely. Oh, right in the nick of time. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. Chance to play it in. Doing well to keep possession. And Kai Havertz. Royce might go for teamwork. Sané. Really vital interception here. Can he finish this? Routine, really. Now a decent position, going for the dink, oh and that is an audacious chip, well he might smile, the goalkeeper has no interest in smiling. Well here's the replay and he shows great awareness to play this through ball, and just look at the finish, that's a brilliant piece of skill and vision to chip the goalkeeper from there, what a great goal.
And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And there goes the final whistle. Germany have won the fifth World Cup. And what a performance from these players. Germany have been absolutely brilliant in this tournament. These players following in the footsteps of Mario Götze and company when they defeated Argentina eight years ago, Stuart. And this has been as good as any tournament for them. They've been absolutely outstanding with their football. Tactically, they've been brilliant. And just listen to these fans. They've got right behind the team. It's been a great performance. Gnabry. And they square the game. 